So speaking of Wolfenstein, what the fuck has 3D Realms been up to lately? They've had sort of a beleaguered history, and I'm not going to go into it. But, well, Thank you. let's sum it up with <laughs> Duke Nukem. Ooh. So they kind of mothballed themselves at some point, but they're back. I guess, under a different name. Team technically, Podcorn? I think yeah, they're technically Apogee Podcorn. Software. But anyways, this is their new thing. As we head toward a new age, an age of boundless technological progress, we head towards a sea of unforeseeable challenges. Forces, both political and industrial, both local and otherwise, seek to irrevocably tie us to an increasingly globalized world. They seek to strip us of the things that make our lasting democracy so great under the guise of a unified Earth. No fate. Our way of life. Terminator. A simple people. A people controlled by an insidious and Oh cool, the president has an iPad. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they strip us of our sovereignty and the prosperity of race. Skrillex is a cyborg. <laughs> and a girl! <laughs> Kick-ass bubblegum. Daniel Johns. It's a reference. Right. Okay. Reference to Duke Nukem. Where? In the text at the bottom, it says oh. kick-ass bubblegum. Nice. Okay. What are you? I don't know. The trailer's incredibly boring. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like yeah, she has a robotic hand. You get it. And, and she's got boobs! <laughs> what kind of a room is she in? It's like a big black warehouse. <laughs> With smoke walls. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. Uh, Harley! Buddy. Let's go. Take one some room photos. She keeps everything. <laughs> she should be wearing a helmet. Yeah. Safety first. And then she blew up her house. <laughs> <laughs> no, every time she leaves, she has that fire show. Ah, uh, that has ain't no good. This is a tech demo? Really? Oh, no. Very, you know? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh, that's their no. tech demo. That's Her hair's not this even is blowing in shot. the wind. Terribly the dead eye stare. Do. I don't know. <clears throat> he doesn't look good. No. Uh, it looks like it was made by somebody with an insanely limited budget. Like it looks like they gave this to like two guys and said, start some hype for us. And they're like, oh no, how long do we have? You Taking gotta get a it out. Into the yeah. race 20 minutes? Be a real 20 minutes ago. That. Did they not think anyone Wait, what was who that? Wasn't <laughs> Taking a rocket to the face can be a real pain in the neck. <laughs> Is that their receptionist got them her to Taking a rocket to the face can be a real pain in the neck. Okay. It can be. It can suck. It can totally suck. <laughs> yeah. As opposed to those those other times where it totally rocks. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know what's happening though. Like it's so confusing. They were showing like outtakes, but they didn't do any voicing in the. It's bewildering. Thing. Yeah, they didn't bother with any actual lip movement in the trailer. I don't understand. I so don't confused. like the internet's really hating on it. I don't want to just straight up hate on it. I'm confused. I just feel like there's got to the be more. The yeah. story behind how that was created and why. Why did they think that was okay to put out and why that would yeah. be That's something That's the main that thing. Why was it okay to put out? Why did to you release? think this was a good thing to do? Like, what's the state of 3D Realms right now? They've been in a really bad state for some time, and it looks like, evidently, they continue to be. Um, who's running shit there? It's like it's, it's kind of as mysterious as Atari. Atari, mm -hmm. like, which is a company that has changed hands ten times now. Like, yeah. they are definitely yeah. not what they used to be. Um, Time will tell. Well, I just have to wait and see, I suppose. But it's it's uh, 3D Realms more than anything, and that Duke Nukem credits reel. Remember um, for the most recent Duke Nukem that apparently goes on for fucking ever <laughs> because of its ten years in development and how the company just had turnover and tons of employees that went through there, and they had to keep track of all the employees. Oh kind of reminds me of like the analogy about the body and how you aren't who you were like seven years ago or something because mm -hmm. of your cell regeneration. Yeah. God, I think about that once a day. <laughs> same Whoa. same yeah. thing with, with really same thing with companies though like we talk about companies as though they're this entity 
But there's probably nobody there that was even there, like, you know, four years ago, let alone when we knew them from back yeah. in Duke Nukem sure. days. Yeah. And it's just, not. that's, I think, more than anything about that, tr that shit show that we just saw. <laughs> What's going on there? Who's behind it? And why mm. are they being forced to make stuff like that? Yeah, it's a little weird. All right. So we'll be right back. <laughs>